Boy, Eric Rube, how are you feeling? Very cold right now and very ready to get this last <laughs> race what? done with. So you're going to go for it? That's right, all okay. the way. No, all the best. Ask why Thanks. you're not using a mouth guard. Because uh, it's uncomfortable. Oh, okay. There you go. Well, I think he should be wearing a mouth guard. Now, all you BMXers, make sure you wear a face mask or a full helmet or a mouth guard like uh, Andy Patterson's wearing here up on the left-hand side of the gate. So for the US pros, Andy rides for the blue team. Nelson Shannaday rides for the white team. And Clint Miller, the world champion, rides for the green team. The black team, that's uh, Harry Leary, also put on his gloves, another central piece of equipment. And uh, Brian Patterson rides for the silver team. There's Eric Group uh, for the red team. And the gold team rider, Mike Miranda. It looks like he's going to fly the course. Greg Hill for the yellow team is on the extreme right of the gate. And there's his sign, you'll lose. Well, will he win this one and put the rest behind him? Watch the light! Surging off the gate, and there's 800 pounds for the first man to finish. And it's Harry Leary's after. He's not won one yet. He made a good start, Harry Leary. And big Brian Patterson is after him. It's Harry Leary taking the inside line. Patterson after him. Then Miller in third place. No sign of Hill, though. Leary's in the lead with Patterson in second place. This is the long haul up towards the top part of the course. And Harry Leary pulling on those bars, lifting that front wheel. And over these twin jumps they go. Wow, look how Patterson flew it. And he's gone past Leary in the air. That was sheer speed and determination. And he's got to stay clear now in the finishing straight because Leary lost a lot of ground. The speed jump presents no problems for Brian Patterson who coasts into first place for his team. In second place, Harry Leary for black. Clint Miller was third for the green team. Amazing jump over the doubles by Brian Patterson which gains him a bike length.